We're here at Strawberry Creek Nature Area and we're going to pick up a few geocaches and hopefully drop off a travel bug or two. So why don't you join me? Well, it's uh, about 90 feet to go to the first geocache and uh, it's downhill so far, so the hike has been quite easy. I've been wandering around a little bit in the woods for this one. But I think I've spotted it. And there it is. You can't beat finding a double can in the woods. And a well kitted out double can as well. Lots of different swag. I'm not taking any swag, but I will be dropping off this travel bug, so why don't you come and get it? All back in place. I think I might be able to see this one already. The sun is glistening off it. Looks like it's glistening off an ammo can in the woods. Again, another well kitted out geocache hammer can. Lots of swag, just like the other one. Looks like an angry cat. Come and get number 36. And it's always good to get a smiley. Once again, I'm going to drop off a travel bug to get it on its way. This is a complete new one, and hopefully, somebody will pick it up soon get it on its travels around the world. I decided to hide it just a little bit better but who can resist an amacan in the woods? Why don't you come and get it? Well there's two containers of this one and uh, this one looks like it's been chewed away by animals and somebody must have dropped this one fresh so I'm going to put them back in place and uh, leave them for the next person to find. All good to go. Why didn't you come and get it? Well, I found all three geocaches that are here in the Strawberry Creek nature area. And I dropped two travel bugs out a couple of them. And uh, they'll be hopefully moving along quite soon. The only trouble with climbing down into a riverbed area is that when you come out it's got to be a climb. Hey but just remember keep on cashing. <laughs>